Gabe Hartland and Dylan Miller organized a week-long fundraising campaign at Southern Kings Consolidated for a young person in a neighboring community suffering from cancer. The two friends don't know Colm Thompson, but they both feel it's important to give back. Me and Gabe were actually doing the clock for a hockey game, and we were talking about this Callum Thompson who has uh, come down with leukemia. And I right away thought of my grandfather who the past winter had leukemia. And I just didn't want a younger child to go through what my grandfather had to go through. So we decided to do some fundraising. I just felt bad for him because he's only in grade two or three. And I just felt really bad for him. And then he had to go through this. Well, I told the principal about it, and then he agreed that we could do fundraising for Initially, him. the boys came to me, uh, the grade 7 class, plus Gabriel from the grade 6 class, because they participate with um, these kids in hockey. Now, we all obviously don't go to the same school, but we're all part of the same community. They showed the initiative, they came up with the ideas, they put the plans in place. So anytime the kids are doing something along those lines, we try and encourage it in each other. I discussed with my teacher and my class came up with 70s, 80s, 90s day, hat day, pajama day, gum day, and we did a bake sale. I think what was cool for me as a teacher was just because our social studies program especially, it's um, called Investigating Empowerment, and so we talk a lot in class about empowerment and um, kind of as a teacher, allowing students to take things kind of into their own hands. It's a lot better than I thought it would be. Like, I thought it'd just be Mon and Gabe's class, but my teacher helped out a lot, and she got it so that the whole school can do it with us. And that way we raised a lot more money. I was pretty impressed out of 180 kids in the school who made $750.